Hi, my name is Janelle. Due to the isolation wahala, I had to sort out movies that could keep you company in these trying times. Kasala came up in the radar. I chose it because it was chosen out of a total of 39 films from 15 countries for the closing gala of the 2018 edition of Film Africa in London. So I said to myself, there must be something about this movie. The movie centers on four young boys, TJ, aka Starboy, who dreams of a great life beyond the ghetto. Abraham, aka or death, <laughs> who kind of lives up to his alias. Chikadi, aka Efiko, who is saddled with so many siblings, I call them the fighting squad. <laughs> the children can fight there. <laughs> and then F Young, aka Hustler, was kind of like the entrepreneur amongst all of them. TJ took Uncle Taju's car, who is his master, on a joyride with his friends, and Abraham bashed the car. With a couple of hours left, they had to raise 20k to fix the car, and guess what? The car got worse, and the streets were not nice to them. They went to extreme measures to make the money, got defrauded in their quest to fix the car, and then their desperation hit another note that they used all they made on a freaking bet. Meanwhile, Uncle Taju was in a terrible situation. His debtor was at his heels and threatened to take his car away, gang, gang. Hmm. Question now is, would they be able to make the money in time to fix Uncle Taju's car? Or would just better sleep pot, which is their final hope? <laughs> what type of casala would the boys be in? <laughs> The car was kind of like the center of the casala of the movie, but one minute the car's windscreen was broken, the next it wasn't. I just couldn't understand that. And I'm guessing the movie is supposed to be a comedy, but it seemed a bit strained and um, delayed. For rookie actors, the boys did marvelously well. The synergy was electrifying, their dressing and their swag was hilarious. Yeah? And the movie captured the social ills of our society in a subtle way. It didn't distract us from the main plot. And that is very rare to find in Nollywood. I love the originality of the movie, the PJ mannerisms and street attitude. It just gave it a sense of reality. And then the music, oh my God, <laughs> it was awesome top-notch beautiful music i give this movie a three star rating don't forget to share like follow and comment on my social media handles at janelle's nollywood diary please stay safe